Hey, welcome to Wireless Solutions. Today's video, we are diving into an important topic. How to back up your iPhone to Windows PC for free. If you own an iPhone, you are probably aware that Apple offers only 5GB of iCloud storage. This amount is sufficient for storing notes, documents, and keychain passwords, but it falls short for keeping your photos, videos, and other files. Essentially, you can back up crucial items such as notes, messages, Safari data, and select app data. However, if you intend to back up your photos and videos, this is not feasible with the free storage plan. So let us get started. You do have the option to upgrade your storage plan for more iCloud space, but this upgrade does involve a cost. If you wish to create a backup of your iPhone on your PC to safeguard your data in case of any issues with your device, follow this detailed step. Start by connecting your iPhone to your PC using a lightning cable. When prompted on your iPhone, tap Trust this computer and enter your iPhone's password. Once the connection is established, switch to your PC screen. Regardless whether you are using Windows 10 or Windows 11, the first step is to install iTunes. You can do this by visiting the Microsoft Store and downloading iTunes or by manually downloading the setup file from Apple's official website and following the installation instructions. After installing iTunes, open the application and proceed to sign in with your Apple ID. This step is necessary to enable synchronization between your iPhone and iTunes on your PC. Next, ensure that iTunes recognizes your iPhone. You should see your device icon appear in the iTunes interface under the Devices section. If you don't see it, restart your iPhone and computer, then check again. Once your iPhone is properly recognized by iTunes, navigate to the Device Summary page. Here, you can choose to back up your iPhone to this computer rather than iCloud. This option allows you to keep a local copy of your data on your PC, which can be crucial for quick and secure restoration in case of data loss or device replacement. Furthermore, if you decide to encrypt your iPhone backup, which is recommended for protecting sensitive information like passwords and health data, you will be prompted to set up backup password during the process. Make sure to remember this password as it is required to access and restore your encrypted backup. Finally, initiate the backup process by clicking on the Backup Now button within iTunes, depending on the amount of data on your iPhone. This may take some time. Ensure that your iPhone remains connected to your PC throughout the backup process to avoid interruptions. If you opt to install iTunes from the Microsoft Store, start by searching for iTunes and follow the prompts to install it. Since I have already completed this process, I won't detail it further here. Alternatively, if you prefer to download iTunes manually from Apple's website, search for iTunes Download and click on the provided link. I will also include the link in the video description for your convenience. Once on the Apple website, choose the appropriate version of iTunes compatible with your PC and proceed to the download and installation steps as directed. For Windows 10 and Windows 11, it is recommended to download the 64-bit version of iTunes. Here is a detailed guide for the installation process. Number 1. Download iTunes Go to Apple's official website or the Microsoft Store and search for iTunes. Ensure you select the 64-bit version suitable for your operating system. Number 2. Install iTunes Once the download is complete, locate the installer file and double-click to begin the installation. Follow the on-screen instructions to proceed with the installation process. Number 3. Open iTunes After installation, launch the iTunes application from your desktop or start menu. Number 4. Sign in with Apple ID On opening iTunes for the first time, you will be prompted to sign in with your Apple ID. Enter your Apple ID and password in the provided field. Number 5. Verification Code For security purposes, you may need to verify your device by entering a verification code sent to your trusted Apple devices or phone number associated with your Apple ID. Number 6. Complete Setup Follow any additional prompts to complete the setup process within iTunes. Once you have signed in with your Apple ID in iTunes, you can choose to skip any prompts to update your iPhone if you prefer. iTunes will proceed to synchronize with your iPhone automatically. To confirm the connection and access basic information about your iPhone and backup options, look for the device icon 
next to the music option within iTunes. Click on this device icon to view details such as device capacity, software version, and available backup options. If you do not see the device icon, ensure that your iPhone is securely connected to your computer via the lightning cable. If necessary, restart both your iPhone and computer to reset the connection, then check iTunes again for the device icon. This step ensures that iTunes can effectively communicate with your iPhone, allowing you to manage backups, synchronize data, and perform other essential tasks seamlessly from your Windows PC. This setup will allow you to manage backups and access essential information about your iPhone through iTunes on your PC. In the Summary tab of iTunes, you will find two options for backing up your iPhone, iCloud and this computer. For a backup on your computer, select this computer. You also have the option to encrypt the backup to protect sensitive data such as password, health information, and HomeKit data. To encrypt the backup, set a password and ensure you remember it by writing it down. Click Set Password to proceed. iTunes will then initiate the backup process, encrypting all data before storing it locally on your computer. The duration of this process varies depending on the amount of data on your iPhone, so it is important to be patient until it completes. By selecting this computer and encrypting your backup, you ensure that your iPhone's data remains secure and accessible for restoration purposes, offering peace of mind in case of device loss, damage, or data corruption. iTunes also offers options to update or restore your iPhone. The Update option updates the iOS version on your device, while the Restore option resets your iPhone to factory settings or restores it from a backup. You have the flexibility to manually create backups of your iPhone on your computer or restore your iPhone from a backup using iTunes. These are the main options available to you in iTunes for managing your iPhone's backup and updates. If you are wondering where your iPhone backup files are saved, you can find them by navigating to this PC, Local Disk C, Users, Your Username, Apple, Mobile Sync, Backup. These files are encrypted so you won't be able to read them even without the password. There are third-party software options available to decrypt these files in case you need to recover data from a lost iPhone, which I will cover in another video. In iTunes, under the Edit menu, then Preferences, and then Devices, you can manage your backups. From here, you can delete existing backups or reset the sync history. Creating a backup of your iPhone on your Windows computer ensures that if you ever lost your iPhone's data, you can restore it from the backup. While iCloud is a convenient option for backups, it does come at a cost, making backing up to your PC a cost-effective alternative. That covers the basics of creating and managing iPhone backups on your Windows PC using iTunes. And that is all there is. We hope that these meaningful solutions brightens your day. If you found this video helpful, Make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tricks. Thank you for watching and stay safe online. See you in our next video.